once upon a time in deep, deep winter, when the snowflakes were falling like feathers from the sky, a queen sat at a window with a black ebony frame, sewing. And as she looked up from her sewing at the snow, she pricked her finger with the needle and three drops of blood fell upon the snow. And because the red looked so beautiful against the white snow, she thought to herself, oh, if only I might have a child with skin as white as snow, lips as red as blood, and hair as black as the ebony window frame. took a second wife. She was a beautiful woman, but she was proud and haughty and could not bear the thought that anyone should be more beautiful than she. She owned a magic mirror that always told her the truth. And every day she asked it. Mirror, mirror on the wall. the fairest one of all. Lady Queen, you are the fairest one of all. Snow White grew up and became more and more beautiful. And when she was 16, she was as lovely as a bright sunny day, and even more beautiful than the queen herself. people talked of Snow White's beauty. And when the handsomest and richest prince in all the land heard about her, he decided to come to the castle to see for himself. Come to see Snow White. Let him pass. Why have you come here, Prince Charming? I want to see Snow White. No one may enter the castle. The Queen has given me strict orders. But I demand to see Snow White. The Queen fears that Snow White has become even fairer than she herself. Therefore, she keeps Snow White a prisoner. The princess is not allowed to leave the castle. Come and look. 
There she is. How lovely Snow White is. Hunter, you must promise to come for me if the princess is ever in danger. I promise you, Your Highness, if Snow White ever needs you, I will come and get you. Tell her she's the fairest of all. And give her this gift from me. It's a necklace. I want her to wear it. Think of me till I come back again. I shall go to her at once with your present. Thank you, Hunter. And you won't forget what you've promised. If Snow White is in danger, come for me. I give you my word, Prince. <laughs> Princess. Mm -hmm. Princess Snow White, I have a surprise here for you. What is it, Hunter? It's a present from Prince Charming. Oh. He saw you standing at the window and asked me if I could let him in, but of course I couldn't. He wanted to speak to you. Then he told me to give you this present. That necklace is for the fairest woman in the land. He wishes you to wear it till he comes back again. A necklace for the fairest woman in the land. Then it belongs to me. Give it to me. The necklace is mine. The prince gave it to me as a gift. Your Highness, that is the truth. Give me that necklace. The prince comes. What do you want? Your Highness, the carriage is waiting for you. I shall not go out today. Leave me alone. Mirror, mirror on the wall. Who is the fairest one of all? Lady Queen, you are fairest here, it's true. But Snow White is a thousand times more fair than you. Snow White, you say, is fairer than I. A thousand times fairer than I. Snow White is a thousand times more fair than you. Francisca! Francisca! Have you been listening? No, Your Highness. I would never dream of listening. Send in the hunter. Yes, Your Highness. Come here. I have something for you to do. I am at your service, Your Highness. I cannot stand the sight of Snow White any longer. 
take her to the woods. And kill her. No, Your Highness. I can't do that. Little Snow White, that good dear child. That good dear child is beginning to get in my way. Good dear child. Your Highness, I can't... Hunter, I am your queen. I command you. I can't do it. And if I offered you a thousand gold pieces... I wouldn't kill Snow White for money, whatever you offered. So, you defy your queen, do you? And the rest of your life will be spent in a dungeon. Well, now, will you do as I command you? Yes or no? What's your answer? Yes, Your Highness. Good. Go at once and take Snow White into the woods. And do what you have to do. Your Highness, I... Go! And not a word of this to anyone. Attention! It's the princess! I've been told I should be careful when I go into the woods. Mm. But all the animals are my friends. That's right. I hope we're lucky enough to see a deer. Do you believe we will, Hunter? We might. Or a nightingale. Or an owl staring at us with eyes as big as saucers. Snow White, we have a long way to go yet. Come on. 
We still have further to go. I won't go any further. Hunter, take me back. Aren't we going to go home now? Snow White, you will never go back to the castle. Don't talk like that, Hunter. It scares me. Why do you look at me like that? What's wrong? Did I do something? The Queen is an evil woman. She has ordered me to... What? She has ordered me to... Tell me, Hunter, what is it? She said I was to kill you. Oh, I beg you, Hunter, please don't kill me. I'll stay here alone in the woods. The Queen will never know about it. The Queen made me promise I would kill you. But I cannot do it, Snow White. Here is the necklace. The one the Prince gave to you.
lights are on in our house. Somebody must be there. Careful. Let's go quietly. It might be a thief. What if it's a monster? Or a dragon who breathes fire? Stop. Did you hear something? No, I didn't hear anything. Did you? No, me neither. All right, let's get close together. Come on. Shh. Quietly. Follow me. Get our cloaks out first. Wow, after a scare like that, I could certainly use a glass of good warm milk. Who's been sitting on my chair? Who's been eating from my plate? It wasn't me. Who's been nibbling at my piece of bread? Who's been eating my spinach? Who's been using my fork? Who's been cutting with my knife? And who's been drinking out of my cup? There must be somebody in the house. I knew all along there was somebody here. Come on, let's find him. Yes, come on. Get your lantern. No one in this corner. Nobody here. All clear under the table. Everybody upstairs. <gasps> Somebody's been lying on my bed. And on mine, too. And mine. Maybe he's hiding under the bed. Quick, come here. There's someone lying on my bed. It's a girl. It's a girl. A beautiful girl. How did she get here? She's fast asleep. Where did she come from? She must be very tired. She's so big. She doesn't look dangerous. No, but what are we going to do with her? Hide. She's waking up. Seven dwarfs. What are your names? I am Whitey, and the next one is Bushy. I'm called Eddie, and I'm called Teddy, and this one is Freddy. My name is Blackie, and I am called Bim Bam. And who are you? Yes. yes. Who, who are, are you? you? My name is Snow White. My father is the king of this whole land. Snow White. What a beautiful name. She's a real princess. Who rides everywhere in a golden coach? How did you come here? Did you lose your way? How did you find our house, Snow White? My stepmother sent me all alone into the woods with the hunter. He was supposed to kill me. What? Why did she do a thing like that? But the hunter's a good man, and he spared my life. Well, it's that a must lucky have been thing a turn. Sure is. Who knows what could have happened to you? I guess I'd better be going now. But where will you go? Why do you have to leave? You can't just go out into the forest. Why don't you stay with us? Yes, Snow White, stay oh, here Oh, please, Snow White, do stay. Oh, yes, please, Snow White. Oh, please, please stay here. Do you really want me to stay here with you? Yes. yes. Shall I cook for you? Yes. yes. And keep everything clean? Oh, oh please, please. And wash all the dishes? Yes. yes. Do the sewing and mending? Yeah, look at this hole in my pants. <laughs> you like it here with us, Snow White. Oh, yes, we'll have lots of fun together. And when we're out working, we'll leave Snow White in charge of the house. Yes, and sure keep it in order for us. We'll have plenty to do, Snow White. You won't get bored. And in the evenings, we'll play lots of games. Hey, yes, watch me. me. Look what I can do. Too. I can turn cartwheels. Can you really? So can I. Look. Oh, let me see. I can crow like a rooster. Oh, show me. Got the doodle doo Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and I can quack like a duck. Watch me. Quack, quack. Good, Jim, Dad. Come on, Hey, let's have some music. Ah, music. Snow White, can you dance? Yes, a little. Beat it. Please, won't you be my partner?
Snow White and the seven dwarfs danced and danced till it was almost morning. But somebody else was not sleeping that night. Look, the wicked queen is still awake. Oh, she's waiting for the hunter. Mirror, mirror on the wall. Who is the fairest one of all? Lady Queen, you are fairest here, it's true. But over the seven mountains far away, where the seven dwarfs stay, Snow White is a thousand times more fair than you. Snow White is alive. So the hunter didn't kill her after all. Francisca! Francisca! Yes, Your Highness. Has the hunter returned yet? Yes, he came back a few minutes ago. Bring him here at once. Your Highness, you sent for me? No, White is alive. You disobeyed my order. The order of your queen. I couldn't do it, Your Highness. I couldn't kill Snow White. You'll pay for this for the rest of your life. God! Don't be too hard on me, Your Highness. I tell you, I just couldn't do it. Silence! Throw the hunter into the dungeon. Keep him on bread and water. What do you suppose the wicked queen is doing? Oh, she's disguising herself in some old clothes so that Snow White won't recognize her. What do you think will happen when the wicked queen finds so white? Oh, isn't it lucky that the dwarfs are still at home? 
Let's hope they can protect her. Boy, is this good. Best breakfast we've ever had. You should have had a cook, Snow White. Did everyone enjoy his breakfast this morning? Yes, yes. yes. I did. I did. I and did all of you clean your place? Who's going to help me tidy up then? I, I will, will, so I. Fine, you two help me clear the table, and the rest of you start tidying up the house. Yeah. Okay. Come on, fellas. <laughs> Snow White. What do you do? We go over the seven mountains to our mine, deep, deep down under the earth. Down there is gold and silver and precious stones. We mine it from the rock and make it into jewelry. Snow White? Yes? Yeah. Shall I make a beautiful bracelet oh, for yes, you? Oh, yes, please. I'll make it specially for you. Come on, we must go now, fellas. Yes, it's getting late. I want to be back early to see what Snow White has for supper. Shoo, shoo. You think you'll be happy here, Snow White? Yes, I'm sure I will. Then you must stay forever and ever, right, boys? Sure, sure is. is. Snow White, today you're going to be all alone in the house. Watch out for the wicked queen. Yes, because one of these days she may find out that you're living here. You don't have to worry. I can take care of myself, all right. Goodbye. 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 Up the and down again. Wicked Queen. Oh, she's not very far from the dwarf's house now. Thank you. 
Good day. I hope I didn't scare you. No. Are you all alone? Yes. But where are the seven dwarfs? They've gone to their mine. They won't be back till this evening. Ah. I have some lovely belts here. Take a look. And dainty laces. And pretty ribbons. Let's see what there is. How do you like this belt? It's beautiful. And this one? It's even prettier. Well then, come on, let's go inside. You can try on all the belts I have. I'm sure it'll fit. Try it on and see. Come here. I'll help you. Oh, isn't it pretty? Just my size, too. Mm hmm I think it could be a little bit tighter, don't you? Let me see if I can fix it for you. What are you doing? Not so tight. White as snow. Red as blood. Black as ebony. Now I am once again the fairest one of all. She laced me up so tightly that I couldn't breathe anymore. The peddler woman was the wicked queen. Yes, yes, I read it. Of course, that must be. I know it was. No, no, it wasn't the wicked queen. She looked completely different. Yes, yes, it was her. She dressed herself up as a peddler woman so that you wouldn't recognize her. She's sure to be back, so don't trust anyone. And don't buy a belt from anyone. And don't let anybody come into the house. No, I won't let anyone in again. I'm so glad that Snow White is alive and well. of all. Lady Queen, you are the fairest here, it's true. But over the mountains far away, where the seven dwarfs stay, Snow White is a thousand times more fair than you. When the Queen heard this, she thought up a new scheme. 
even more wicked than the first one. And she got ready to go over the seven mountains to the dwarf's house once again. Good morning, my child. Would you have a cup of water for a tired old woman? Yes, of course. Oh. Thank you. Could I sit down and rest for a little while? Of course, over there. into the house. I can't allow anyone in at all. The seven dwarfs have forbidden it. They're absolutely right. You shouldn't let anybody in. But there's no reason why we shouldn't choose a comb out here. How do you like this one? Very much. Uh, I'll put it in for you. What lovely hair you have. Now, who's the prettiest in all the land? That gets rid of you at last. Just like that for the moment. I must look this up in my medicine book. But I'm going to put this on her to cool her forehead. Okay. I've got to look this up very carefully so that I don't make any mistakes. 
Look, she's better already. Yes, she is. I'm glad we decided to come home early. Whitey, have you found anything yet? No, he's still looking through the book. Here it is. She should stay in bed and be covered up to get warm. She must stay in bed and be covered up and kept warm. Come on, our clothes will help. Yes, and our blankets too. She must also drink three cups of green mint tea. Then she'll be all right again. Snow White, you must never do this again. Of course, the wicked queen had found out through her magic mirror that Snow White was still alive. So once again, she busied herself thinking up a terrible scheme. That very night, she searched through her book of witchcraft. This time, she was determined not to fail. She will die this time. I shall kill her, even if it cost me my life. With the deadly poison in this apple, I'll destroy Snow White forever. is going to kill Snow White with a poisoned apple. How do you know? I was listening behind the door. I heard her say so. I must go right away and warn the prince. 
Franks, as I promised. How can I get you out of there? I don't know where the key is. There, it's hanging over there. Where? Over there on the wall. No, white. It's very foggy, so no one will see you. Go on. to try and persuade you to buy something from her again. She'll never leave you in peace. Never. Don't buy anything. And no one in the house, do you hear? Don't you worry. I'll be careful this time. Come on, then. Let's go. Goodbye, everybody. Goodbye. 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 Goodbye
No, thank you. I don't want any apples. Look. Here's my juiciest apple. Take a bite and see. Don't you trust me? Very well. Then I'll cut the apple in two. The red half is for you. Take it. And the white half I shall eat myself. Delicious, isn't it? can be an A help, Snow White. <laughs> Fritz, a thunderstorm. I don't like the sound of that. I don't either. Do you think the Wicked Queen has done something to Snow White? Quick, let's go home. Finish up there. Get your coats on. Hurry. Listen to that thunder. Maybe Snow White is in danger. Maybe something's happened to her. Yes, quick. Let's go home. There's no comb in her hair. She's not wearing a belt. That was the Wicked Queen. What did she do to her this time? Shh! Quiet a moment. I can't hear her heart beating. Snow White is dead.
Stand in front of the coffin. It's the seven dwarfs. Why have you two come here? We're looking for Snow White, the king's daughter. You're looking for Snow White? Who are you, anyway? I'm Prince Charming. The wicked queen is trying to kill Snow White. That's why I brought the prince here. But we haven't found a trace of her anywhere. You can stop your search now. Snow White is dead. Dead? The wicked queen did kill her. Give me Snow White. I'll give you a rich reward. No, no! We wouldn't exchange Snow White for anything in the world. Dear little dwarfs, I have been searching all over the land for her. The necklace that she is wearing was a present from me. What? Was, was it, was it really? really? I love Snow White and cannot live away from her. Give me her coffin. Over here, everybody. Snow White must stay here. Why does he want to take her away? We won't let him. We'll keep her here with us. But he seems so much in love with Snow White. Yes, he does. But all the same, she's ours. But look at him. He looks so sad. And Snow White always wore his necklace. Perhaps she loves him, too. Could be. Prince, since you love Snow White so very much, you can take her with you. Thank you, you good little dwarfs. I'll take Snow White back to my palace. And I'll honor and cherish her. Forever and ever. Come on. Hunter, get the horses and follow us. necklace which you gave to me. I was to wear it until you came back again. Snow White, we'll go back home to my castle, and then we'll get married without a moment's delay. Yes? Yes. And then we'll all have a wonderful party. And you can all eat as much as you want. <laughs> and you'll come and live at my castle. What's the matter? Don't you want to come to the palace? Yes, but, uh, you see, Snow White, we're not used to the world of big people. We don't really want to leave our little house in the woods. But we'll give you a party. Here, in the woods. 
I'd like it. Oh, I'd love that. Wait and see. We dwarfs can fill the greatest parties in the world. Yes, we are happy little people. Yes, I can see that. Come on, then. Off to the wedding feast. <laughs>